income tax refunds, which even then I did say, and even now I'm saying, that is people's own money, taxpayers' own money. But why am I including it saying here? Refunds have gone in a big way to the people because in time, if they get the money, the refund, it will help them. 1,32,800 crores have gone as refunds to nearly 39.7 lakh SSEs. It's their money. I'm not making a claim to that. But refund, instead of sitting with us for whatever reason, which is not right, without any delay, has been given to the tax assessees in time. Prime Minister Rozgar Protsahan Yojana is something which all of you all already know. It exists. It was implemented up to 31-3-2019. It had covered all sectors beginning textiles and then it is expected to run three years. It is running for three years. So even if somebody joined the scheme on 31-3-2019, they would be covered under that existing scheme for another, I mean, from then three years. It is still uh, active. Up to today, there's about 8,300 crores which have been disbursed to the beneficiaries, and uh, there are about 1,52,899 establishments which are covering that many number of 1 crore 21 lakh 69 thousand odd beneficiaries under the PM Rozgar Protsahan Yojana, which is an existing Yojana. The new scheme, which we are now calling as Atmanirbhar Bharat Rozgar Yojana, is being launched so that we incentivize creation of new employment opportunities uh, so that the recovery phase benefits from it. What does this mean? It means that every EPFO registered establishment, those registered establishment, if they take new employees who never were covered by EPFO earlier, if they take them on, or if they bring in employees who had lost their jobs between 1st March 2020 and 30th September 2020, even they will be counted as new employees, although they may have an EPFO number earlier, both will benefit from this. This will be effective from 1st October 2020. So EPFO registered organizations which recruit new employees from 1st October will be covered. They will be covered for the next two years. The earlier scheme covered for three years, now it will cover for two years.